Hello gems, welcome to Avakin Addiction Magazine, Mino. In this video I will be showing you how to find and use the new feature. It is really cute, it is the cutest thing ever. Now, drag out the left side tab. You'll see all those little small tabs and your profile picture. Tap your profile picture and then in the left hand side just by your titles there's a little small icon that says avatar now tap that as you can see you already get these pre-made avatars already done for you i have used some but they're not very good as the custom ones in the left side where there's the green head icon thing that's the custom button now here's a, an example of a custom i did earlier let me show you how to make a custom avatar now it shows you at the top what you should do and what you should not do keep face as clear as possible with no obstructions in the way and then select a picture of you from the gallery. I'm going to pick an old picture I have used for Facebook. And now at the bottom there's three icons. A male icon, a female icon and a rainbow for different genders. The rainbow, it doesn't do anything just yet. It's new, it's coming soon. It, nothing happens. And because I am a female, I am going to use female icon. In that now, at the bottom... There is a bar, a loading bar, that tells you how long it loads. It takes about a minute to eight minutes to load and download to create your avatar. Now that your custom avatar has loaded, it would look something like this. But don't worry, if you don't like it, don't worry, because you can customise it as well. With the three little icons just above the pre-made slash custom avatars, you can change the background, you can change the clothes, and the skin colour. Also, the avatars use your camera, so whatever you're doing with your face, like blinking, talking, the avatar also mimics that. It's quite handy quite cute all in honesty with the clothes that you have available you don't get much option unfortunately but hopefully over time amino does add more in there's also a limited range of hair cells on the left hand side next to the hairs is a colour bar thing you tap and then you can change the colour to anything you want and because I am a brunette naturally in real life I am obviously going to be biased and pick brown also there are a range of different glasses to choose from as well in hats like I had said before there's also tiaras as well, headbands. It just depends on your preference of choice, what you prefer. That's all. With the skin, the lightness is the shade of the skin, how light you want it to be. You can also have different coloured skin. You can have pink, blue, green, purple. You can have it as dark as you want or as bright as you want. It's all down to you. The choice is yours. You can also spin the avatar around so you can have a good look at them just to make sure you're okay with the hair and the colour and everything else. And once you're happy with everything you can then save the avatar. But be warned you can only have a maximum of two custom avatars. You cannot have any more than that. Don't worry, I can and will show you how to delete custom avatars so you can make 
room for more or redo some. Okay, I'm going to briefly show you examples of two more already made avatars. There's this little ghost one. It is absolutely cute. It is adorable. And there's this um, frog dragon thing. I'm not sure, quite sure what it is. So I'm just going to say dragon because it has little horns. So it probably makes sense. This one is a custom one I had done earlier. Like I had said before. And also, like I said earlier in this video, you it um, mimics your head movements. You can also record the head movements. You can yawn, you can sing, you can mime, whatever. It also picks up background noise as well. You can um, save it. It doesn't uh, post onto Amino, but you can, as you can see on the options below, on the screen that you can post elsewhere like Instagram and Facebook so that's quite handy as well and there is how you delete a custom avatar if you do not want it anymore